Hi everybody. So, I know I haven't recorded in a couple days. I did record yesterday and I'll post that in a little bit. I did leave the house yesterday. I went to the PX and we went to go find a dress for my daughter. It's the first Valentine's Day dance that she's gone to. She's 13 and I'm a stubborn mom. I wanted to go and find a dress with her and I went and found a dress with her and I'm hoping to share some pictures later and I hope she had fun. Um, but I really haven't shared too much of the experience with you guys so I'm actually in bed right now and Adam might not be too happy with me. <laughs> But um, I've been hurting all day today. I did overdo it yesterday. Uh, so my upper abdominals almost feel like I got punched in the gut. Um, it's not sharp. It's just that dull ache. And that puppy you hear crying, that's my daughter's puppy. You'll see him in a little bit. Um, but yeah, the pain has kind of spread to the upper abdominals because, I mean, from what I understand, the from an abdominoplasty, they, they tightened my ab muscles as well since they've been loosened from my pregnancies. So, I'm actually in bed right now, and I'm going to videotape myself trying to get up. So, I'm going to try and get up now. Oh, my God. It's better, usually, if you, like, slide, roll to the side and, like, roll up. And that's what I just did. So I just slide over. Ooh. Oh. Oh, and there we go. Oh, and that flag behind me, that's my father-in-law's flag. Um, he passed away a little bit over a year ago. So here we go. Mm. The main problem I have, and it's been happening a lot, is I forget to unhook the drain that I have on me. Oh, so since this is so tight and my pretty much all of my ab muscles are uh, being redone, um, I really can't stand up straight. Um, so, oh my goodness. Oh, and this puppy is just being an incessant little whiner. But I was trying to hook the drain, but... So, you know, I have to, like... I have to walk hunched over at all times. Um, but, yeah, um... I've just been lying in the bed, and I've been in there a little bit too long. Um, Adam had to go and pick up Rebecca from her dance, so I'm hoping that she had a good time. Um, oh... But yeah, I've been um, trying to walk it off today and it's actually been a lot harder today than it's been in the last few um, because the pain is so high. Um, I really haven't shared any pictures of how it looks, but I took a picture in the hospital and um, I'll go ahead and take another picture of how it looks without the bandages. So you can see how it's different and healing. But yeah, yeah. Oh, you can see I gotta, I gotta stay tucked in. But I've been taking my medication. Um, I've been staying with it today. Um, I'm just hoping I get a better night's sleep. So there's the puppy, and he's actually trying to get to some food. So let me try and hi Jasper. I gotta get that away from him. Hold on. Oh, that puppy. Oh, goodness gracious. Mm. So, yeah, one of the good things is that when I left the hospital, it, they gave me a, a binder. So, I mean, that's what I'm wearing. I'm wearing a really tight binder under here. And um, I would show you guys, but um, it kind of exposes <laughs> a little bit too much down there. So... But, um, yeah, just I need to make sure to stay on my medication and to hydrate and drink water. Um, and, yeah, give yourself permission to heal. I'm stubborn. I'm just so stubborn. <laughs> 
but yeah I got to give myself permission to heal and I've been resting today and binging on Deep Space Nine with my husband but um, yeah it's been a rough day today this is what uh, today is actually a week exactly. Last Tuesday I had this procedure done and I think I would be healing a little bit better if I wouldn't have overdone it and I need to I need to stop. God I'm a stubborn little one aren't I? But um, I'm, I'm gonna be okay and I'm gonna keep on my medicine and I'm gonna try and sleep um, and I'm gonna take my husband's help instead of being stubborn and trying to still do things for myself. Um, thanks for following me, guys. Um, hopefully I'll be able to start showing you some of the finds that I find in my garage, because that's my next goal is to start going through my garage and see what things I find on there that um, are possibly sellable on eBay or you know, for me to resell them. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh wow, look at that. I just got a sale on eBay <laughs> while I'm talking to you guys. That's awesome. All right, well, there's my sweet thing for today. <laughs> um, so I really hope that you guys have a great day. That just made my day. <laughs> I sold something, so maybe I'll show you guys what I sold a little bit later on, but um, that was pretty cool. <sighs> oh my goodness. All right, so I'm going to have to tell my husband, and he'll package that up for me tonight, and we'll send that off in the morning. Um, that'll be great. <laughs> so that's one of my side things that I'm doing, and... I'm still working on another um, form of income so that I can keep going and build more savings and hopefully retire at a younger age. <laughs> so um, you guys have a great day and remember to always think of at least one sweet thing. If you think of at least one sweet thing a day then it'll start piling up and you'll start noticing the good things in your life. Um.